Hey, 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 hey. What the heck? Are you guys too old to be doing shit like that? The fuck? Anyways, we're gonna do a quick audio test with the Grom because I don't have the fairing on this one. So it shouldn't be too bad wind noise. I have the advisor open right now. So let's see the difference between visor open and close. We know it's visor open. It is open. Test, test, test. Test, test, test. Test, test, test. Now we're gonna close the visor. Completely close. Right there is completely closed. And. Uh, I'm been moving my microphone right now, like different position. I did a little test inside of my house, and I think the microphone it was too close to my mouth. So I think I put it down a little bit. I think it's gonna pick up better audio without getting my freaking fat ass breathing. Just to see the difference. Difference between one. Bike lane. We don't have a fucking bike lane here. Why are you talking about bike lane? Stupid. There are like bikes are cracked open. Bikes are fully closed. Doing 55 miles an hour. Cross winds. this helmet because I like the look of the helmet it was cheap $150 plus I changed the visor another $30 I mean 180 wasn't too bad at right now and I wasn't even looking for the helmet I was just I just bought it because it looked cool and I mean <clears throat> to be honest with you already needed a, a, new, a new helmet the one I have I had like I guess five or years already I mean it's been a long time time to upgrade to a new helmet I think but I wasn't expecting buying this one I was trying to save money to get a Rurok that's what I want a nice freaking helmet all right right now we're going with the wind coming back this way we're gonna right against the wind and we'll see the difference right now let me open the uh, vents see if it makes any difference the top ones are open bottom the chin one is open already yeah okay let's go back in here I mean I can hear a lot of noise inside of the helmet cheap helmet but it's really comfortable it looks cool and it feels good it fits better than my old one the one I've been using all right we got this I can feel air everywhere there you go I close the vents top ones and the chin one right against the wind Hear the noise. We'll see right now. We're going back home and uh, man, let's go explore this way. I've seen people going that way. Let's see. I feel like I can get in there. I mean, my chrome's already all dirty. Oh, shoot. off roading. people here oh look at that boat who came in that freaking boat in here oh shit oh, 
hopefully I don't get in trouble with the freaking police. Oh, oh, oh. What is this? Look at all this freaking mess. Do we have, oh shoot. Do we have tweakers in here? Freaking crackheads? Oh, 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 oh. What's that? Red thing. Is it camper shell or something? I don't know. Let's get the fuck out of here. Because before we get in trouble with the police, because I know they've been shutting down places like this lately. I was wondering to explore this area. It's so close to my house and oh that's why I mean, look at all this fucking mess. Come on people. A freaking boat. Who comes and dispose a boat in here? If you reason the boat AZ9321A1 it's right here. <laughs> By the Broadway in the 202 Come get your boat Woo. I want to hit this trail this trail now this area with my RM80 What's up, brother? How you doing? Good. That's good, man. One more test run. Full throttle. There you go. You guys can hear me clearly. 58. So, um, um, something I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna order the um, the front sprocket and the rear one. I've been riding with these guys. They only the only modification they have done to their ground so far. It's just the sprockets. I think I think they said the one tooth up on the front one and two down on the back. And they're freaking bikes, man. They're freaking fast. I have the intake, the intake, and the um, ECU flash. I paid like almost four hundred dollars for the whole thing, man. And I can barely keep up with them. And they only spend like seventy dollars with the sprockets and the new chain. I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> and I spent all that money. So that you're telling me I did wrong, but we'll see. I mean, I can do 64 on a flat surface and uh, no wind. Hopefully, I can do more changing those sprockets. We'll see. All right, guys, that's it for the test.